Hello, in this video we are going to maximize utility when we're dealing with a fixed proportions utility function. Sometimes these fixed proportions utility functions are referred to as perfect complements. So here's an example of a fixed proportions utility function. The consumer's utility, u, is going to be the minimum, the minimum of either 2x or y. X is units of good X. Y equals units of good Y. Units of good Y. Utility maximization requires that the consumer consume good in X in such a manner that 2X equals Y. So this is required for utility maximization. Okay, This condition right here. All I'm doing is taking what's in parentheses here, okay, the 2x and y, I'm just setting those results equal to one another. We could, one way to interpret this is that each unit of x must be consumed with two units of y. So given this setup here, this utility function, it's implying that each unit of x must be consumed with two units of y if the consumer is maximizing utility. Okay, so the next step then is the consumer's budget constraint. I'll just write a general format for the budget constraint. M is going to be income, the consumer's income. P subscript X is the price of good X. P subscript Y is the price of good Y. And the X and Ys are units of good X and units of good Y. Let's assume that the consumer has $140 of income. The price of good X is $10. So P subscript X is 10. The price of good Y is $2. So now we have the consumer's budget constraint. All we're going to do now is take the utility maximizing condition here and plug it into the budget constraint. So Y equals 2X. Where we see a Y here, we're now going to write 2X. So we're going to get 140 equals 10x plus 2 times y, where y is 2x. So 140 equals, this is just going to be 14x. So x is going to equal 10. As for y, just take this result and plug it back into this y equals 2x. So the consumer is going to consume 20 units of good y. And those combinations of x and y will maximize a consumer's utility. To figure out the exact utility of this consumer, plug in 10 for x and plug in 20 for y. So utility is going to be the minimum of 2 times 10 which is 20 or 20. So this consumer has utility of 20. And that's how you maximize utility with fixed proportions.